Welcome to the Stephen TV. Let's use your leads tonight. He raises that's the match review. How are you doing, Dad? I'm good, mate. I'm really good. It's been a bit hectic this morning, but I'm good. Um, how are you? Yeah, good, yeah. Um, right, um, Lee. Yeah. First of all, it w Leeds, Lee, it wasn't the best performance I've ever seen from Leeds United. No. Right? But we got the job done. Yeah. You've got to let me share screen again. Okay. So this is the match report from um, the stats I appeared for. Right? So if you look at this, right? As you can see, goals, Leeds 3, um, Leicester 1. Expected goals. We, we were supposed to get, on average, 1.33 goals. They were supposed yeah. to get 1.95 goals, close to two goals. The expected points. We were supposed to get 0 0.90 out of that game. They were supposed to get 1.87. Um, they had 16 shots to our 15. But this is the this is the big one, Lee. Expected goals per shot. Mm. Ours was 0 0.09, theirs was 0 0.12. You know, they had the majority of the game, and this proves it here. Yeah. Right? So this is Leicester's here. Look how much dominance they had. Look at this dominance, all this dominance they had. Right? Mm -hmm. We started getting back into it a bit in the second half, but from this minute here, mate, I mean, look at this. Look at this second half. Right, this is this is um, this were their um, XG um, timeline and it's related. They were all over us in that entire game, yeah. It, for for a majority of the game, they were all over us. Um, now what that tells me is that they were the pet aside, but Leeds United just re finished that game so strong. Look here where we started to we really started to rank the pressure up down here. You know, that's where we really started to rank it up there. They look at that. You know, that's that that where our performance levels going up and up and up. So that tells me that we you know, for the first 60, 70 minutes, it were all Leicester. Mm -hmm. After Leicester, um, we come right back into it. But it the game changed when Leicester, um, when um, Leicester, when, when Maraska brought off Indidi, um, Mavididi, or whatever he's called, when he started making them changes and brought on um, um, McAtee and Cotton, I think it was right, that's when the game swung Leeds United's way, yeah. You know, it was a fantastic ending, the crowd were absolutely electric, would have been good to go to that game, you know. Mm. Would have been really good to go to that game, but look, we we, we did next best thing. We were involved in a watch run, and you know we 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 could express how we felt through when them goals went in. But I wasn't impressed with uh, some of the some of our players. Like I wasn't mm. impressed with Perot. I wasn't impressed with Rut with um not with um some of Rut have tried too hard at times, most of the time. I thought um I thought Commander did well, he were all over pitch. I thought yeah. Gurev did well. Um yes, I know they took the goal off of um Archie Gray, but he played well. I have I, you know, I'm not gonna let anyone slag Archie Gray off because he's he's 17 year old. You know, he, he he's gonna make mistakes when he goes forward. The problem with Archie Gray is he got himself so far forward, he left spaces in behind. And Rodon had to do a lot of covering. But Rodon were pretty good and solid yesterday mm -hmm. as well. Yeah. So I did a review and I said that Leeds United can win the league. Now I don't know if that if that were just in ace or what, but do you think Leeds can win legally? Uh yeah. You do? Yeah. I do and know. I do, mate, I do. And that so far, I mean, Hull and um, West Brom last time I saw it, it were one all. So at half time, so. But yeah, I mean, look, there's uh, there's there's a lot of work that you know we, we've got to we've got to be clinical with players when when it needed it. But 
but we've also got to be um, re, um, praising the players as well. You mm -hmm. know, when when it, need, when it were needed, and we, we, we should have been clinical of them in first 70, 60, 65 minutes, then clinical for um, over 25 minutes. Yeah. You know, praise them up for over 25 minutes. So I think, Lee, like, going forwards, I can't see us being beaten at Ellen Road. I, with no no team's going to come up well on road like Leicester. No team is going to come like that. No, no. And Leicester now, let's let's um. I'll tell you what we'll do, Lee. We'll have a look at the table. Uh, let me share the screen. Bear in mind, I think there were a fifteen point gap at one point uh, between us and Leicester. If you look at that now, Lee, there's a, there's a six point gap between us and Leicester. Mm. They've lost two on bounce now of Leicester. Um, Southampton um, have, have been losing games. Ipswich have started to get back. They've got, they're on a free game unbeaten run, so we'll see how they do. Hull, um, free game unbeaten run. You know, but the, 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 the fixtures in um, the fixtures in um, the fixtures in March are very very kind to us. You know, we should be looking at maximum points. I aren't bothered about this Chelsea game, FA Cup. It's it, it, it's a day out for Leeds fans. You know, they, they, they deserve this day out. You know, they've been with them from Wigan Finn and stuff, so they deserve this day out at Chelsea. I aren't bothered if we win or lose, I'm not bothered. As long as none of his players get injured, that's all. Mm. I'm, that's, all that's the only concern I've got is his player injuries. Because yeah. if we cannot rely on Pro to get us through. Um, the rest of the season, if we need Bamford to be fully fit now, we can't. You saw how poor it was. I mean, look, I should be talking to you about Perot because you like him, but you saw the difference from Bamford come on to when Perot were on league, yeah. So, I, I did, did you expect that? That I mean, you went to 4 0 Leeds when you did, but I, I thought it was going to be close. Mm. You know, and it should have been Leicester should have been two or three up. Yeah. They just didn't have chances. Mm. They got punished by Leeds for them missing their chances. So you know, it's it's all good. It's all good, mate. It's, it is and going forward, Lee, we are we are gonna lose at any games, if any. Honest, I don't think we are. I just think we'll have that strong in, in final third. And when Farco yeah. wants to put a kitchen sink at it, he's got the Arsenal on the pitch, on the um, bench to do it. You know, Connor Roberts getting his first goal. That were a good goal. Um, mm -hmm. That made it 1-0. Um, Archie Grace deflected. Um, effort made it 2-1. And then um, so, um, Dan James's um, 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 free kick in last minute. Let me let me talk out again. Um, then you know, letting then um then um you know um James scoring it from a uh, scoring a um a um a, from um free kick come off of Bamford's knee, I believe. That third goal, late like, come off of Bamford's knee. I don't know. I, I was really you know, touched Bamford's knee. Fair enough. Well, I thought it did. You don't think it did? That's fine. But it doesn't matter anyway. But the no. bottom story is we won 3-1. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? We won 3-1. Um, and we move on. We move on to the next game. Yep. You know, brilliant subs by Farker at the right times as well. I've got to I've got to praise him. I give him a lot of criticism when he um makes subs at run times, but he got it spot mm -hmm. on today. He got it spot on yesterday. Really did. Really, really did get it spot on with. So yeah. going forward, mate, excited for um, last um, th um, thirty is it thirteen games at season, fourteen games at season left. Mm -hmm. Are you are, are you excited now? Yeah. Yeah. Good. 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 So we'll do a re we'll do a preview for the um, Chelsea game beginning at week. We'll look into that a bit more. Um, but yeah, I just want to, you know, I know, I know that you wanted to get this um, pre this review done, and we've done it. So, thank you everyone for um, subscribing to Lee. I don't ask for the disabled team, but Lee, I know it means a lot to you, mate, doesn't it? Yeah. 
it does done it so yeah look guys unless you've got else you want to say lee was still unbeaten still unbeaten we've got us 2000 um um career win as uh, leeds united yeah brilliant absolutely fantastic one would you not would to take scanly yeah right well then uh, do you want to uh, wrap this show up for you Thank you for watching on East Stevens TV. It's a good bye from me, guys. Go on, Lee. Come on, Lee. Take care. Go on, Lee. <laughs> Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>